Hello and welcome to Entrance, a hypnotic meditation library which acts as a gateway to help you discover your deeper self. These recordings are of a hypnotic nature and should not be used while driving a car or operating machinery. Please use common sense and use only the appropriate Entrance volumes in appropriate places and environments to ensure safety. Please seek professional advice if you are receiving treatment for any clinically diagnosed disorder before using Entrance. Before we begin this journey deep into your subconscious mind, I want you to know that self-hypnosis, like all hypnosis, is voluntary. And if for any reason you want or need to become wide awake, you can do so easily and calmly at any point. Before we begin, you may wish to loosen any tight clothing or footwear. And trance is produced to be listened to on stereo headphones. The tones library may be used on loudspeakers and in a quiet environment. You may wish to close your eyes for each session or fix a daydream stare on a comfortable spot in front of you until your eyes are closing. Whichever is the most comfortable for you to relax. I'm going to count back from 10 to 1, and any time before I get to 1, you can allow your eyes to comfortably close as you begin to relax now from 10, 9, 8, your mind may wonder, and that's fine, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one, eyes closed now. Soon when you hear my words, I want you to simply take a long, slow, deep breath and fill your lungs with air. And I want you to do that now. Breathe in and hold it. And hold it. Now, that's right. I want you to breathe in another deep relaxation and feel that relaxation. Flood that relaxation to every cell in your body and hold it. Then let it go. And all you have to do is simply begin to relax. As you now do begin to relax more and more with each breath that you take, and now I would like you to imagine either a blue or gold ball of warm light directly in the center of your forehead. You imagine that warm, pleasant color. You can easily focus on it. Now with the abundant power of your imagination, you can easily begin to transform that color you chose into perfect, warm relaxation. As you do this, you can begin to flow that warm relaxation into your face and over your scalp, relaxing you, soothing and taking you deeper and deeper. As you continue to relax, you let go and your mind wanders and then drifts back as your warm relaxation now floods around your jaw and around your neck. Tiny muscles in the back of your neck carry all the stress and all of the strain. They relax and let go. And you go deeper. And the deeper that you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you go. 
all of the external sounds and happenings. They mean nothing temporarily. Your subconscious mind pays attention only to the sound of my voice. The meaning of my words now flow that relaxation down to your shoulder muscles and your upper arm. And that's sliding down through your elbows into your forearms comfortably and warmly through your wrists and your hands on to your finger. Now before we continue I want you and your mind to repeat with me the following sentence three times. Deeper and deeper and more relaxed. Deeper and deeper and more relaxed. Deeper and deeper and more relaxed. Now as you focus on your back, your shoulders can easily begin to flow that warm, comfortable color down to your chest and into your upper back, down into your stomach, and your lower back, into your buttocks, and into your hips. Now your entire body simply automatically continues to relax. And you go deeper now, and move that lovely warm feeling down to your thighs, sliding through your knees and your shins and your calves through your ankles into your feet in your toes that's right now as I can count back from ten to one you can go a little deeper with each backward count. And as you do go a little deeper with each backward count, you can simply flow that warm wave of relaxation down through your entire body. And my voice will go with you now from 10, 9, nothing bothers you now. Nothing disturbs you. Seven more relaxed than ever. Six. Five. Deeper, that's right. Four. Three. Two. One. Two. Perfect relaxation.
Now, I want you to visualize or imagine that you are on the top floor of a large department store. I want you to visualize an escalator that is moving lots of people down to all of the lower floors. The escalator is moving very slowly and the people are holding onto a black shiny handrail that is moving at the same speed as the escalator. It's very safe. You watch as the people are moving down, down, down. Very confidently, you step forward and hold on to the hammer. You begin moving now, slowly, down, down, down. Riding down this escalator will take you deeper into relaxation. Now, as I begin the countdown, you will find that the lower you go, the more comfortable and the more relaxed you will become. 20. That you are becoming so, so very tired. 19. So, so relaxed. And you enjoy this wonderful relaxation. 18. And you find yourself even allowing yourself to let go completely. 17. You give yourself the permission that this is what you want to do. 16. More and more relaxed. 15. Feel every bit of stress in your body start to drain from your toes. 14. And with each number now, you feel twice as relaxed. 13. You become more than twice as relaxed now, twice as much as the one before. 12. Concentrate on the center of your mind. 11. Experience your inner self now. 10. Deeply relaxed as you pass the men's department. Nine, let yourself go more and more. Eight, you are passing the bridal department now. Seven, deep, deep, more relaxed. Six, as you pass the children's department, you become more and more relaxed. Five, deeply relaxed, so comfortable. Four, pass housewares now, deeper and deeper. Three, more and more relaxed. Two, one more floor to go now. One, there, deep, deep relaxation. Now that you have reached the bottom floor and that you are totally relaxed, just let yourself go completely as you now go deeper, deep and deep.
And as you pay attention, you can focus on anything inside or outside of your body that will help you experience yourself more deeply. And as you go further into your deeper self, you can open up even more if you wish, becoming more receptive to the thoughts and the images and the suggestions that will help you learn and develop whatever is ever is most useful for you at this time. Trusting that your unconscious knows what to respond to and to let the rest pass by. As you go deeper now, you can allow your subconscious to use whatever amount of light trance, whatever amount of medium trance, and whatever amount of deep trance you feel comfortable with. And you can appreciate that imagery it's not, not always making sense into the logical, logical conscious mind. It's very, very easily understood by your unconscious mind. You are completely relaxed. As you continue to let go more and more, and more. you are aware of everything. And yet, you are not aware. You are, you are listening with your subconscious mind. While your conscious mind is now far away. And listening. Or not listening. It matters not. Your conscious mind can focus on anything internal or external to you to help you experience yourself even deeper. Your subconscious mind is coming awake and now listening and hearing everything. Your conscious mind remains very relaxed and peaceful. You can continue to focus on anything or indeed drop, drop into a deep sleep now. You can relax peacefully because your subconscious mind is taking charge. When this happens, you can close your eyes and let your subconscious do all the listening. Your subconscious mind knows, and because your subconscious mind knows, your conscious mind does not need to know and can stay asleep and not mind while your subconscious mind stays wide awake. You have much potential in your subconscious mind, which you do not have in your conscious mind. You can remember everything that has happened with your subconscious mind. You can forget so easily, and with forgetting certain things, you can remember other things. Remembering what you need to remember, and forgetting what you can forget. It does not matter if you forget, you need not remember. Your subconscious mind remembers everything that you need to know and you can let your subconscious mind listen and remember while your conscious mind sleeps and forgets. Any problems that the mind has created can indeed be solved by the same mind. You have had the solution to your problems already, whilst there are many shades of grey. Essentially, they are all either dark or light. As you continue to listen to me with your, with your subconscious mind, your conscious mind sleeps deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper. Let your conscious mind stay deeply asleep and let your subconscious mind listen to me.
want you to imagine being a child on a holiday now. On a warm beach with the sea comfortably lapping around your ankles. As the tide goes out, it leaves a mass of plain sand, perfectly ready to be drawn in with a stick. Draw a large box, and in that box draw the number 100. Now, when you're ready, use your hand to gently smudge out the 100, but leaving the box. In the box, now draw the number 99. And then, slowly, smudge out and smooth the sand again. And so on, down to the number 1. So, 98. Look long and hard at it. And then, Brush it out with your hand. 97, and the same again. Ninety-six. Be careful not really to rub the light. box around it when you're rubbing it out. Ninety-five. And rub out. Knowledge without wisdom is like coming in the sound. 93. I now move and go in the Russian direction that I want to grow. Strong. 92. Ninety-one. To help you relax anywhere, anytime, ninety, you can use this that technique. Right. We're about to tense and relax your whole body. Beginning at the feet. Eighty-nine. Tense them. Feel yourself the toes becoming to the ball of the heel. Relax with each number ten of the weight. And relax. Eighty-eight. Now your lower legs. Feel ten. Relaxed comfort. Flooding into your mind and relax. body now. Feel the relaxation 80 flooding into your legs. Brush now. away the number to make a smooth surface ready for your upper legs. Tense. 86. And relax. That's it. You're drifting. 85. And carry on yourself now. As I begin to speak area. about something else. Tense. Take Holding on to anger is like grasping a hot coal. Your, your chest, chest and shoulders and someone else. You're the one who gets tense burned. them. Gently hold. And relax. A running now, river is a metaphor for life. Mind completely. Ever changing but continuous. Very gently. Traversing Tension through ups and downs. Sometimes and fast and furious and sometimes calm and serene. Now let go and feel your whole body begin to drop deeper into relaxation. Now.
This is far from being the only effective way to deal with joint and limb pain. It's just a method which we have found to be useful on a good few occasions. Okay. Now, you're lying or sitting so relaxed. I want you just to think for a few moments about that pain. Just let your mind observe it in a detached sort of way. So that it causes little discomfort. Far less discomfort than you're actually used to, in fact. And I wonder if you can now put a colour to that pain. Just imagine what colour that pain would be if it were to have a colour. Is it maybe a sort of red? Pain is often a sort of red colour. Or maybe it's a bright yellow. Many people have said that pain is a bright yellow colour. Good. Well done. Feel the colour. I bet you never thought of that pain as having a colour before. Now here's something similar for you to think about now. I want you to imagine what sort of colour there would be if there wasn't any pain. Just let your mind think about that for a moment or two. What sort of colour might there be if there was no pain? Just comfort. Just comfort where the pain used to be. What sort of colour is that? Where the pain used to be? Could it be a sort of green, perhaps? Or maybe more like a blue? A lot of people see their comfort colour as a sort of blue colour. But maybe you have your own healing colour. Good. You're really good at putting colours to feelings, using powerful creative imagination. Very clever. Very well done. Now, what sort of colour would we get if we mixed the pain colour with your comfort colour? Okay. So if we manage to get some of the pain colour dissolving into that healing colour, it will concentrate it to be nearer the healing colour, right? Okay, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Here, you have to use your own skills to decide what's best. Imagine a lotion or a gel that can be repeatedly applied. A special bowl or bath where healing fluid can pour from the taps. A tub of healing balm or a big tube of penetrating ointment. Whatever will work best for you. So we have a huge tub of that healing gel. But just for the moment, I want you to imagine plunging your hand into that tub of gel and taking a really big handful of it. Can you feel that in your hands? Is it warm or cool? Good. Now, in your mind, just rub that gel gently into the affected area. Can you see it changing colour? It's changing to the healing colour, right? Now, you can feel the pain steadily diminishing. And as the pain steadily diminishes, now notice your breathing. Notice every breath that you take. You're breathing in cool, fresh oxygen and healing energy. Imagine this oxygen and energy rather like a cool stream or a river flowing in through your nose and mouth and down into your body. 
relaxing and soothing you. What sort of colour is that stream or river of energy? Could it be a sort of cool, clear white perhaps? Or maybe a cool, clear blue? A lot of people see that healing oxygen energy river colour as a sort of blue colour. But maybe you have your own healing river colour. And that's fine. And that just direct a strong healing stream of that river, rather like a farmer would channel life, giving water from a river into a certain area. Direct this flow of healing energy and oxygen to the area of your body where you have rubbed the soothing healing cream. Notice how deeply that soothing healing stream flows through this area. You'll notice how that stream just washes away any discomfort to be absorbed into the earth far away from your body. And this will continue with every breath you take, even after we have finished here today. That's good. Now, in your mind, just rinse that gel away with the cool, clear water. Just rinsing away the pain that used to be in your body. Doesn't that feel good? Okay, now let's do all that again. Just grab another handful of that gel and gently rub it into the affected areas. Now, what's happening this time? The colour is changing far more slowly, right? That's because there is far less pain now to change the colour. And next time, the colour will hardly change at all. That's great. Now in your mind, just rinse away that gel with the cool, clear stream of water and healing energy. Just rinsing away the pain that used to be in your body. And that feels so good. Repeat this process. All the time, the stream of healing oxygen and energy flowing over and through this area in your body as you dream. Good. You did that beautifully. Really well. Isn't the power of the subconscious amazing once you have learned how to communicate with it? Now, you will be able to do that whenever you need to. Just relax as much as you can and then do exactly the same as what we've done today. Each time you do that, the benefit will last even longer. Okay. And now it's time to bring the session to an end. Just knowing that a tub of healing gel is always there for you whenever you need it. And that river and the channel is now flowing continuously in your body as you go about your daily business. Each of these ideas has left a deep, vivid and permanent impression on your subconscious mind and each day in your everyday life you become more and more aware of the full powerful expression of these creative ideas
it's time to come back to the present now, out of this deep relaxation. The subconscious mind will begin to transfer all of the beneficial new learnings you've made to the conscious mind, the emotional mind, and the physical body. And as the unconscious mind now begins to start that transfer, I will begin to bring you back. In just a few moments, you are going to wake up. I'm going to count from one to five. At the count of five, you are going to come back to the here and now, feeling wide awake, feeling wonderful in every way, feeling so much calmer than before. One, start to wake up and emerge from hypnosis. Two, feeling wonderful awake in every way. Three, coming back to the here and now and sensing the room around you. Four, your eyes are beginning to open now as you wake. And five, eyes wide open, wide awake, and feeling wonderful in every way. Thank you for using Entrance.